Yesterday, I got a special delivery. It's the new Tokina 1116 F2.8 ATX Pro DX for digital SLRs Mark II or something along those lines. Tokina 1116, it's ultra wide angle lens designed for cropped sensored cameras and for cropped sensors only, which means you cannot fit this onto a full frame camera, but it's kind of cheap. Okay, so this is the lens. It comes with both the lens caps and a lens hood. I got this from E-Infinity, link is in the description. If you wanna check it out, you definitely can. This has an aperture of 2.8 and it's the widest aperture a wide angle has, I think, at least for cropped sensors because there is a 16 to 35 for Canon, which is also a 2.8. But this is specifically made for cropped sensors like the ADD, which I have. Anyways, this is only unboxing and not a review, so let's throw this on and let's see how it looks currently I'm using Sigma 18 to 35 which means I'm at 18 millimeters this is like the framing there's this beautiful Sun that came out today but now it's in the way I don't like it okay let's throw the lens on okay so this is how it looks when I'm zoomed out to 16 you can already see the door and when I zoom out to 11, you can almost see the whole door. One downside, one thing I heard about this lens is that it's out of focus, it's kind of loud. So let's try it out right now. I know you hate this sun and I hate it too, but I need some kind of lighting. I'm really sorry. That is really loud, that is really not good. Okay, it's not the worst, but it's definitely not the most silent I've heard. But it's freaking wide. Imagine you're going from 4.5. Now it says I'm correctly exposed at 4.5. I'm at ISO 500 and it's during the day. So imagine it's night and then you suddenly drop to 2.8 and you're overexposed by two stops almost, okay? That's insane. Then you can drop the ISO from 500 to 160 and you're freaking exposed, okay? Anyways, there's nothing I can show you right now because I'm a little bit sick, so yeah. The review is coming very, very soon. If you want a comparison with the Sigma 18 to 35, I will be more than glad to do it. So yeah, if you want a comparison between Tokina 11 to 16 and the Sigma 18 to 35, write it in the comments, okay? Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye.